my beloved child. This message holds the key to resolving your troubles, but your heart must be open to hear and embrace the love I offer you today. See how deeply I love you. I speak gently, urging you to be brave and unafraid. Don't lose heart or overlook the victories you've achieved or the blessings you've received. Don't give up. Listen to me. It's for your benefit. Soon you'll encounter opportunities ahead, but stay sharp and attentive. Let the divine guidance steer your destiny. When it's time to make a choice, hold on to me. Take my hand, step boldly, and confidently walk through those open doors. Fear no one, and don't let anyone convince you they are stronger than you. Show kindness, honesty, and fairness to all, but bow to no person. I alone have authority over your soul. No one can dictate your future or take away your blessings. Don't let anyone control your family. Base your decisions on my love for you and follow my words, my truth, and my commands. These are promises of victory and freedom. This is a clear message to your heart. Dismiss fear and erase thoughts of defeat. You're facing tough battles, but I'm by your side to guide you to the end. You're brave. No force in this world, not witches, magicians, or false prophets, can hurt you. I am the only one who died and rose again for you. No one has the power to harm you. Believe this and don't be swayed by empty threats. I will prosper you and bless you. You will work with wisdom, prudence, and all your strength, but your family will always have the place it deserves in your heart. Nothing material is more valuable than your family and spiritual blessings. Come and fill yourself with my word. Listen every evening and every morning. Meditate on my promises when you go to sleep and when you open your eyes. Listen to me again, for I am with you to guide and bless you. For you, there will be no defeat or failure if you allow me to illuminate your steps with this divine light that always surrounds you. Do not go down the wrong path. Do not fall into the traps of the heartless. Do not listen to the gossip that leaves you full of guilt and discouraged. When you walk, lift your head and look towards the horizon. Many blessings are coming, but your spiritual enemies want to steal your opportunity for freedom and true prosperity. Many will come to fill your head with doubts, but close your ears to the words of those who do not believe. Remember this voice. Let these words of love return to your thoughts. Let your heart be encouraged by this love with which I embrace you. Follow me today. Love me. Serve me. Fill yourself with my wisdom. Come to me every day. Receive peace, strength, and tranquility. But above all, learn from me. Be patient. I do not ask you to endure humiliation from people, but I will give you the intelligence to know when and how to respond to all demands. Never speak with shouting. Do not respond with violence. Do not give your enemies the chance to throw your failures in your face. If you have many problems and can no longer endure them, do not run around telling everyone what is happening to you. Your secrets could fall into the hands of malicious tongues, and suddenly, everyone will know the things that hurt you and will humiliate you and mock you. When you face impossible situations, come to me. I will take away your burdens, give rest to your soul, remove all anxiety from your life and erase tension, sadness, and guilt. I will give you abundant life and put a smile on your face. I am the solution to every difficult situation. I have the answer to your questions. The key that opens doors in my written word is the map that leads to true happiness. No one in this world holds your future in their hands. No one decides your destiny. Only I, 
your loving father, your best friend. From today, dare to trust me with all your heart, and you will see how little by little your desperation will end, and your emotions will stabilize. Your life is about to change. Soon you will enter a new supernatural land. Prepare for all the blessings I will soon give you. I have never failed you. I have always been with you, and I have a very powerful reason to stay by your side. No matter what you have done, if I am still here with you, it is because I love you. Look at all you have been through in the past. It is true that you have suffered and cried, and you can still feel the immense pain of the trials you have lived. But you are reading my words. Even when you feel like you're dying, the truth is you're still alive, and you live because I am faithful, and my promise is firm. Because I love you eternally, I always help you and sustain you. I am the one who lifts your arms when you are tired. When you walk through the valley of shadows and tears, I walked with you. In the desert, you thought you would die of thirst. But I came and made water flow in dry places. I delivered you from death many times. Do not let your heart be deceived by situations you do not understand, and do not forget to be grateful. You must recognize that you have changed a lot. The struggles have made you wiser and stronger. If the years did not bring the things you expected and asked for, it is because I always gave you what was best for you to move forward. I did not allow or give you the things that could harm you in the future. I kept away from you people who wanted to ruin you. I took care of you as a loving father takes care of his child. No, I was not punishing you. I know you understand. My only purpose has always been to prosper you, because my thoughts are not your thoughts, nor are my ways your ways. My plans for you are different, higher, and better than your own plans. I want you to recognize this today to understand it, to say it with your words, to write it, to think about it with happiness and faith. You will accept my will and stop longing for those things I took away from you and that will never return. Do this, and new doors of blessing will open, which you did not ask for and did not expect. The desires you hold in your heart are not just a wish or an invention of your imagination. Those dreams you had forgotten will come back to life and turn into plans. I will take them in my hands and transform them into real blessings. With all my love, I want to show you who I am. I want to surprise you. Tell me you believe me. I am your almighty God. Nothing is impossible for me. I never leave you, forget you, or abandon you. I have always been close to you, even when you do not feel or see me and think that the answer to your prayer has not yet arrived. Even when people around you abandon you and you have nowhere to go, tell your heart, my God, my Heavenly Father loves me and is here today. Yes, my word tells you and affirms it. My Holy Spirit is your guarantee and my power is my signature. I will fulfill it. Your mind may tell you that you have lost everything and will never rise again, but I tell you now, face your reality. It is true that you alone cannot achieve victory. You need my strength. I love you eternally, so my support and help you will always have. You will believe this, stand up, and do it in front of all who want to see you fall. I remember very well that day when I saw you crying for the first time. I saw tears rolling down your eyes and watched your heart sadden every time you stumbled. But even before you were born, I already loved you and waited for that moment when you could understand enough to feel my love. So, the day you cried so much, I was there too. I comforted you, I know your tears. I lifted you from the ground and gave you divine strength to be victorious in your battle. You know me well. You know I do not lie. 
and will never fail you. If I was with you before, I am with you today and will continue to be by your side after your victories. I will love you with much affection and extend my hand if you fail and fall again. I was also with you in those moments when you did not reach the goal, when those projects and dreams could not be achieved, and little by little, each of your dreams was taken away. I know you feel alone, and maybe still feel that no one supports you. But believe me, I was always there by your side, hoping you would feel me close to you and speak to me so I could give you a solution. You must remember that for me to enter your life, you must invite me and talk to me through prayer. Only then can I help you and provide a solution to all your problems. I ask you not to be afraid to seek me. I will never deny you my help, no matter what you have done in the past. Because what is really important to me is you now, in the present, and what I can do for you. From now on, you must know that you have my forgiveness, and that with my love, I will cleanse your heart from what causes you pain, shame, sorrow, and lament. I will erase all your sins and fill you with my Holy Spirit. At this moment, while you listen to me, stop worrying and remove from your mind those thoughts born of your desperation. If you think, you will never get out of this situation. You're making a big mistake. Maybe you think it, but do not believe it. Do not feed on the doubts that others discard. Do not accept the negativity of those who live only to fail. Those people feel so good when they find a way to make you suffer. But do not open your heart to those who do not want to have a better future. You can change. I want to transform you. The plans I have for your family and you are of blessing and prosperity. There are people in this world who reject what I send them. They see everything wrong. Nothing I do for them pleases them. They always want more. They come with their demands. And instead of approaching me with gratitude and reverence, they come to blame me for their sins, errors, and imprudence. They ask where I was when things were going wrong, and I answer, where were you when I called you and wanted to give you this beautiful love? Guard your heart, and do not be led by those who have already decided their eternity. There is a path before you, the path of life and blessing, or the path of eternal loneliness. Here I am, with open arms, waiting for you with sincere affection. Return, please, to this home that misses you so much. Focus your gaze on the right path. Enjoy these blessings I have for you. My child, rise in triumph and victory. You are a child of your almighty God. I love you and will never abandon you because to me, you are my most precious treasure. Do not despair if today you feel bad. If you think you are not strong, I want you to listen to me. Open the doors of your heart. Accept this sweet peace I give you and take this time to rest your mind. I am the creator of the universe, and I order those winds that shake you to be silent and keep still. You will no longer hear the whispers of the world's threats that want to scare you. Break your faith, cloud your clarity about what you have already achieved, and make you throw away everything you have accomplished. You think you are weak, but let me tell you something. Pay close attention it is better this way because you realize that your own strength has a limit and that you need me. With your faith and my power, you become invincible. With renewed strength, your spirit is indestructible, and with this word of faith, your weakness ends. You can say with confidence, I am strong. You can walk with hope and without stopping, continue until this mountain where I am. Here I wait for you. This is the peak where your great desires can become reality. Here you will achieve your dreams. This is the place and time for you to accept my will and let me work in your life. From now on, you will soar. I brought you here not to go back. Open your wings and climb higher so you can see from above this land of blessings I want to give you. 
You will no longer live in desperation. You will not go to sleep anguished. You will not wake up sad or discouraged. From today, you will live a life of ardent and active faith. Each morning, as the sun rises, you will decide to be happy in any circumstance and will not allow any bad news or worry to erase that beautiful smile that lights up your face. You are my daughter, my son. Always remember that. You gave me all of yourself. My Holy Spirit dwells in you. You are different. You do not have to imitate what people say or do. Many tremble at any rumor. Their hopes are destroyed and they are filled with fear. But you are not like that. My supernatural love is in you. Your faith is wonderful, and from your lips come prayers and powerful words. Fly now. You are free. Be happy. Go and share these words I've given you today with your family. I love you. Very soon, you will see my power manifested over your family and you. A time of peace, healing, and blessing is coming. I have seen your faith. I am listening to your prayer. Your attitude moves me. I am touched by the sincerity of your heart. Your faith is alive, and you come to me every day. Your spiritual life is important to you, unlike others who come occasionally and don't place their paths and plans in my hands. I want you to teach your family and loved ones to be like you, through your example and good attitude. As your faith grows, so will your spirit, mind, and soul. More blessings will come your way, but so will great responsibilities. I will put you in a position where many can see how I bless those who obey me, who have humble hearts and are willing to wait for my answer without filling with anxiety and impatience when things don't go well. You know your life, your family, and everything you do is in my hands. Many people live full of worries, thinking they are always in crisis and that these times are bad. But all good things are possible for those who love me, submit to my will, and believe in me. You are one of the faithful who has remained steadfast. For you, the doors are open, and showers of blessings and happiness will pour down endlessly. Keep your eyes open at all times and in all places, because a great opportunity is coming your way. Many reject the blessings I send because they believe they are not worthy. On your path, you will see many people suffering, crying, because they cannot understand that someone truly loves them, forgives them, and that their future is not one of pain and death. If only they could shed their disbelief and give me the chance to pour my love into their lives. But you, you will bear much fruit like a good tree. When you grow enough and your arms are strong to hold the blessings I will give you, great miracles will happen in you and your family. I love you. Do not ignore this message. Stay here. Listen to the end. Do not let any distraction discourage you. Do not let your heart fill with complaints and frustration. This is a test of your patience. I want to see that you know how to listen receive, treasure, and faithfully obey this holy word that I am depositing in your soul today. When you rise each day, come to listen to me. I know you are going through many trials and sometimes you don't even have the energy to think. But in this, you must strive and be brave. A word of faith can heal you, encourage you, lift you, and prosper you immediately. It is true. Make the decision today to believe with all your heart that I can change you with my love, my tenderness, my patience, my commandments, and my advice. I can transform this time of tribulation into a new day of happiness and blessing. You are very important to me and to many people. Though some are ungrateful and do not appreciate your love, I see your effort. I admire your commitment to love without expecting anything in return. I record in my book all that you do for them. You are not alone. I'm with you, and you also have a great multitude of witnesses who see you and support you from heaven and earth. 
warrior angels ready to fight battles. Remove obstacles from your path. There are people who love you and pray for you. Your name is mentioned in my presence every day. I gave my life so you could receive salvation, freedom, and peace amid affliction. You will be happy in the days to come. I will reveal to you the power my blood has to bring blessing to your family and you. I want to help you, but I love to see your attitude and sincere desire to move forward. I love seeing you strive for triumph. Promise me you will believe my word. Commit to coming, to hear me every morning. Open your eyes wide and pay attention. Little by little you will notice new and good things around you. The time has come for you to know who I am and come into my presence with all your heart. I love you. I'm giving you my hand. I will change your life. Listen carefully to what I am going to say. Listen and keep these words in your heart. I surround you with my arms and always take care of you. I am by your side in those moments when you can't go on anymore. Remember these words well. When sadness attacks you, think of me. Do not focus your feelings on loneliness. I am with you. That is the truth. Speak my name. Embrace me in your heart and cry no more. Do not water sad memories with your tears. Do not let them take root in your mind. Do not give importance to the past that will not return. Do not feed thoughts or lies that try to steal space in your mind and are destroying you. Remember my sacrifice on the painful cross. I paid for your sins with my powerful blood. Bring to mind my glorious resurrection. I have come to resurrect your dreams, transform your existence, give you eternal life, and strengthen your heart. You have suffered many things in this life, but you have not given up. Here you are, rising again. You are my daughter, my son. You carry my power within you. Today, you will continue on the path to your blessing, and nothing and no one can stop you. I will pour wisdom into you, and as you progress, I will open paths and remove many obstacles. You will see many good things you thought were lost return to you. The secret to reaching freedom, prosperity, peace, and the blessing you seek is to truly believe what I am telling you. Do not stop or give up for anything, and do not fear the problems or enemies that want to defeat you. Now you know what I think. You have heard me say that I want to bless and help you. Now it is up to you to obey and do what I say. Believe me, seek me, rise and walk, because surely you will reach your victory. I am your sovereign God. I know your future and your past. I speak this word to your heart, and as a good father, I command you not to give up or be defeated. Take another step of faith. I want you to keep trying. The chains that bound you have been broken. The walls that stood in the way of your happiness are coming down. But the time has come to act. You cannot stop. Raise your banner and with all your strength, sing your battle hymn. Come with faith and determination, with all your spirit and fight like the champion you are. <laughs> if you weaken in the middle of the battle, I will strengthen you. To you who listen to me and believe, I will show it to you. You will see that my voice speaks and guides you. I have a blessed plan for your family. Even if some things are not going well now, at this moment, you will rise and defeat all those invisible enemies. They are already trembling because they know their time is short. They see you rising and they are losing their breath. I want a look of determination and a beautiful holy smile to be born on your face. Let me anoint your head with the oil of joy. Fill yourself with confidence. When you leave your house to face life, school, work, or that appointment you must not miss, you will face it with faith. Do not fear anyone. If you need to talk to someone, 
Stand in front of that person, and my powerful presence will be there with you. I will give you the exact words to say. You will not be filled with nervousness. I've given you my spirit and self-control so that your emotions are subject to my will. Whatever you have to face, you will do it with faith and much confidence, because I am with you. I did not abandon you when you were far away. I delivered you from danger when you did not remember me. How much more now that you have given me your life will I move heaven and earth so you find the way out? I will put my shining sword in your hands, and your enemies will hear you. You are very brave. You are very loved. Tell me if you still believe that I can perform a mighty miracle in you. Have you thanked me today for another day of life? What are you waiting for? It costs nothing to open your lips and express your gratitude in your own words. I know your needs well before you tell me. Just trust me. Come with me and spend a peaceful time. Find a moment of silence and think about all the things you can give thanks for today. Your life, your family, your health, the air you breathe, the bread on your table, the roof over your head, my supernatural protection around your home, and the warrior angels who camp and guard, who watch over your dreams and are ready to enter the battle. There are so many reasons to feel blessed. You have so many beautiful reasons to hold on to life. You must think about them daily, so your mind is filled with good thoughts. Let your eyes always be open, seeing my goodness in your paths, feeling the security that I hold your destiny in my hand. I dwell in a grateful heart that recognizes it needs me and seeks me with faith and hope, because it knows it is very blessed. Sometimes I see you worried about what happens, but that is normal. Do not worry too much. You feel the weight of your responsibility. You want everything to go well, for there to be provision in your house, health in your family, and for nothing and no one to come and take away the peace and stability you need. But there are also dark days when you forget your gratitude and the enemy comes with whispers, planting dirty thoughts in your mind, turning your worry into fear, surrounding you with lies, transforming fear into anxiety and despair. I'm watching and waiting for you to raise your arms high and speak the words that will make the enemy flee. Thank me for your life, your family, your health, for everything you are and have. Your sincere faith and grateful heart are shields that keep you alive and strong in times of trial. When you pass through the fire on the day of affliction, I will be there. Tomorrow, beside your bed, waiting for you to open your eyes. I want to hear your first words of the day, from your grateful soul, saying, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for life. You will move forward and everyone will see that I am with you. Your blessing is coming, and nothing can stop it. Soon you will receive the answer. Your need will be met, your health restored. The person you love will return to your life. I am telling you this to fill you with courage. Let your joy start today. Very soon, people and family will come to you. I want them to see your happy and rejuvenated face, your smile that impacts them, and to witness with their own eyes the wonderful blessing I will give you in front of everyone. The word has been given. Abundance is declared. I do not lie, and what I promise will come true. Always remember this, constantly, so your mind does not fill with anxiety or worry. I myself put an end to your suffering. Your time has come. Days of happiness and pleasant moments are coming that you should value. Do not fear, my child. Do not cry. Do not despair. Believe in me, for I am your God speaking to you today. Believe it in your soul. I hear your plea. I feel the beating of your humble heart. Your prayer reaches my throne, and the doors of my grace open. 
I pour out my blessings and favor upon you. My presence dwells with those of simple faith, with humble hearts, with those who sincerely and earnestly call upon my name. Always remember that you can trust in my power and my faithfulness. I will never leave you helpless or abandon you. I will never forget you. If I suffered on a cross and shed my blood for you, it was not to forget you when enemies and problems attack you the most, or when you feel weak, needy, and sick. I am with you at all times. I repeat it always so you never forget. I always long for you to seek me every day and remember my words. I have the power to deliver you. And if I tell you this every day, it is because I truly will do it. And I want you to be filled with faith, to go to sleep with peace in your mind, and rest well. I want you to wake up in the morning with joy in your soul, and with the confidence that my promise is unbreakable, and that I will never abandon you. I do not lie. I love you and will always bless you. It has always been so, and it will always be so. Tell me now that you believe it. I want to hear your words of strength and happiness. Take a moment, turn off the light, and remove your attention from the distractions around you. There are many lights, many distractions, but it is time for you to hear my word, directly from heaven, spoken by my mouth, born in truth, written with blood, sealed in spirit, a word that cleanses, a word that heals, created for you. For that day when a sad memory makes you long for the tenderness of my peace and my counsel, because it is not achievements or quietness that bring happiness, nor does peace come when a dream is conquered. The rivers of your mind, running in anxiety, only rest in the presence of your God, your Heavenly Father, and full joy comes when you understand and believe in my wisdom. Wisdom begins when you recognize that I, your Father God, am here with you, in every place at all times, caring for you. Your desires matter to me. And if you give me all your attention and respect, if you turn off the lights that obstruct your vision, if you move away from confusing distractions, and if you firmly believe in my promises, if you delight in my love, and if you can rest your thoughts on my shoulder with simplicity and trust, your God, the Alpha and Omega, tells you this. Close your eyes, for when you turn off the lights of this world, your heart will be illuminated, and in a second, your life will change. You will no longer be a victim of fear, because now you know with certainty that I am here. Receive my rest, receive my peace, turn off the light, feel, receive, live. The darkness outside does not mean loneliness for you because this truth will always shine within you. I love you. Believe it. I love you and will never abandon you. Do not worry. Do not despair. Believe in me and I will lead you to abundance. Beloved child, pay attention to my words, for they come from the depths of my heart. I understand fully that you are facing challenges that make you tremble. The problems and constant financial pressure are an overwhelming burden that gives you no rest and gradually suffocates you. The anguish that surrounds you is like a shadow that prevents you from seeing the light at the end of the path. I know this situation has only led you to a path of scarcity, worsening your emotional burden. You feel like you cannot go on, not knowing what to do to escape this storm. A constant feeling of anxiety and sorrow takes hold of you. The sadness you experience mixes with the frustration from your efforts. All these things have impacted your material well-being, leaving a deep effect on your state of mind, as it is a heavy burden to carry, my child. However, I want you to know you are not alone. I am here to support you in this hard time and lift you from this deep pit of despair. I know you cannot see beyond your problems now, as your hope is clouded and your expectations are slowly fading.
But let me tell you, my child, this difficult stage you are living will pass. The trials, struggles, and challenges are signs that something great is coming to your life. Although this seems like an uphill journey, it will end soon. Trust in me, and trust in the strength I have placed within you. To overcome all these obstacles with faith, determination, and courage. It is time to place everything in my hands and stop trying to solve things on your own. Stop relying solely on your abilities, as they have not always worked. I ask you to trust in me and my plan for your life. Let me work in ways that will bring transformation in all areas of your life. My purpose has always been to see you prosper and experience my love in all its fullness. It is my desire to provide you with an abundant life filled with material and spiritual blessings where neither sadness nor scarcity have a place. But for this, you need to trust in me and believe in my word. If you do, I will give you the strength to move forward, the courage and energy to overcome insurmountable obstacles. Remember, you are not alone in this. I am with you, your guide, your faithful companion who will never leave you. When you trust in me, all these challenges become opportunities. No matter how overwhelming they seem, they will end up being stages that help you grow and get closer to the person you are destined to be. Do not let despair cloud your vision of things. Remember that I am the light that guides you to your destiny. Trust in me, beloved child, for my hands are always extended towards you, ready to help you whenever you need it. If you trust in me, if you open up to the possibility that my plans are better than any strategy you can conceive, you will find in me the peace you long for and the solution to all your problems. I know the path may seem hard and winding right now, but every step you take, every effort you make, I value it. Nothing you do is in vain. Do not let frustration paralyze you or fear stop you. As you strive and trust in me, you will see doors open. Opportunities you were waiting for appear, and little by little, your dreams will materialize. Everything will fall into place. I encourage you, beloved child, to embrace my word and establish a deep bond with me through prayer. I will strengthen you, provide for all your needs. I will make your life flourish and prosper. I will make you a blessed and fulfilled person. The miracle of prosperity I will work in you will be real and tangible. You only need to trust in me and keep hope alive in your heart. My desire has always been to see you flourish and prosper in all areas of your life. Even when times are tough and circumstances overwhelming, my will for you is always good, pleasing, and perfect. Always remember, my child, that my love for you is eternal and infinite. I am always by your side, ready to guide, strengthen, and bless you abundantly. Trust in my plan, trust in my love, and trust in my promises. But above all, Never forget that you are stronger than you believe. With me by your side, you will overcome everything life throws at you. I love you, my child. Today, receive my blessing and my strength, which will accompany you in every step you take until your days overflow with abundance and complete blessing. For you have been faithful in little, and I will set you over much. I will make all your ways prosper. I am your heavenly Father the Almighty God, the Creator of the universe, the owner and sovereign of all that exists. Nothing escapes my knowledge or is beyond my reach. Today, I come to offer you my guidance and direction, an inexhaustible source of grace and love that will fill your life with peace, joy, and purpose. It is necessary that you listen to me, for your time has come. All those trials, challenges, and obstacles that seemed impossible to overcome 
are about to end. So do not give up and keep moving forward. I know you are tired, exhausted by so many difficulties, but you must persevere a little longer. The battles you fight, you will win. Trust in me, for I have the power to make everything go well for you. Please believe in my word, and I assure you that all your problems will be solved. The debts that have burdened you for so long will be paid. Your burdens will be lifted. Your finances will improve. And there will be nothing that, with my help, you cannot overcome. For I am with you, and nothing and no one will stop you. My word is the guarantee that my promises will be fulfilled. Just trust, and I assure you that I will never break my commitments to you. Do not forget that my love for you is inexhaustible, and my power is infinite. You are my precious child, and I desire to see your life flourish every day. Let the light within you shine like the dawn, growing brighter until the day is perfect. Just trust, child and you will see how I transform your difficult situations into opportunities for blessing, growth, and wisdom. For all the effort you make will not be in vain, but will prosper. Every seed you plant in faith will sprout and bear abundant fruit. You will see doors open before you. Prosperity will come into your life in all its forms, both materially and emotionally and spiritually. But remember, child, that the prosperity I pour into you is not just for your benefit, but also to bless those who have less, the needy, the poor, and the humble. Be responsible with what you receive, because if you are faithful in little, I promise to set you over much. Do not forget that my blessing is a call to obedience and responsible stewardship of all I entrust to you. Keep your heart humble and generous, willing to share with those in need. Let me make you a channel of blessing, not only for your brothers and sisters, but also for the poor and needy. Beloved child, it is also necessary for you to know that on your path you will encounter challenges and obstacles. But do not fear. I will be with you at all times, strengthening and guiding you. Do not let adversity discourage you. For in the trial, your character is forged and your true trust in me is revealed. Remember, my child, that my purpose for you transcends the material. Though I restore your finances and your debts are paid, my greatest desire is for you to experience a profound spiritual transformation. That your relationship with me strengthens and your faith is affirmed with every victory and every challenge overcome. Trust in my word, for I will not fail you as I am faithful and keep my promises. There is no limit to my love and power. If you cling to me, if you place your trust in my mighty hands, you will experience the flow of my blessings in your life. Cling to my love and grace, beloved child. Live with the certainty that your finances will be restored, your debts will be paid, and all your financial burdens will be lifted. Scarcity will not touch your home, your children, or your children's children, for I will fill you with abundance in all areas of your life. So, lift your head and look to the future with hope. Do not fear facing the challenges ahead, for I will be with you, giving you strength and wisdom to overcome them. Trust that my powerful hand is working in your favor. Walk in obedience and faithfulness, knowing that I will never abandon or forsake you. Your life will be a living testimony of my miraculous provision, and those around you will see my glory reflected in you. Remember, my beloved child, that all these blessings you will receive are not because of your own merits or works, but because of my grace and love. So move forward with courage and confidence in my word, believing that I am the God who restores, the God who pays your debts, the God who prospers every work of your hands. Keep these words within you, seal them upon your heart, 
so they serve as a constant reminder of my commitment to you, of my unconditional love, and my desire to bless you abundantly. Remember the purpose of these words is not just to fill you with empty promises, but to inspire you to walk in obedience and faithfulness. My desire is for your heart to be aligned with mine and for you to seek my will every day of your life. Today I bless you, my child, and declare you free from debt and affliction. I declare that your finances will be restored and that the works of your hands will prosper. Trust, and it will be so. I love you and will never stop loving you, no matter how far you are. I will never abandon you. I know you cannot see me, but I see you right now. I am watching your steps and accompanying you on this difficult path. I have witnessed the challenges and struggles you have faced, even the sad tears you have shed. But I want you to know that it was never my will for you to suffer so much. I love you, and my love for you is eternal. It is always ready, waiting for you to accept it and take refuge in it with a sincere heart. Sometimes you may feel lost, confused in the darkness and uncertainty. But I want you to remember that you have me, and I will always be near you to guide and protect you. I will never leave you alone. You need to reach out your hand and let me take you, to lead you to the light and show you the way to peace and hope. A place where you will find joy, abundance, and happiness. Trust in me, my child, for the life I offer is full of wonderful plans, plans that will give you a life with purpose and a future filled with victories and blessings. No matter how far you feel from me at this moment, you will never be out of my reach. My grace and forgiveness are always available to you. Remember, my love can break through any barrier and overcome any adversity. Just trust in me, for I will always be there to listen to your prayers. No matter the pain and sorrow, my ears are always attentive to your words and my heart is filled with compassion for you. There is nothing you can do to drive me away. There is no mistake you can make or sin that can separate you from me. My love is stronger than any failure or weakness. My love surpasses all understanding and is higher than the heavens. Let me embrace you in your moments of vulnerability show you the grace and forgiveness I offer. Understand that my love has no limits. No matter how many times you fall, I will always be there to lift you up. No matter how many times you make mistakes, I will always be there to correct your steps and guide you on the right path. My love is constant and inexhaustible, always present in your life giving you the strength and courage to overcome any difficulty. Close your eyes, my child, and let me embrace you. Let the warmth of my presence be like comforting energy. Let my love surround you and provide comfort. I will cradle you in my arms and give you encouragement. Surrender your heart to me, beloved child. Do not fear doing so. I will give you freedom peace and tranquility. Trust in me, for I will be your refuge and strength. Allow me to embrace you and show you true love, the love that can heal any wound and restore your soul. Always remember that you're my greatest treasure, and my love for you will never change. No matter how difficult the circumstances you face, I will always be there to support you. My child, let me embrace you today and show you my love. Wherever you are, give me your heart. Give me all your burdens. Let me be the one to meet all your needs. No matter how far you feel or how dark the path you are on, my love envelops and restores you at this moment. Know that all is not lost because I am with you. Today you can start again. Live once more, dream and hope. For in me you will recover everything you lost, even multiplied because an abundant life is what you deserve. A life of victory and happiness, that is my will. 
So from today, when you feel overwhelmed by the weight of your burdens or afflicted by your worries, believe in me. Put everything in my hands. Let me be your support and strength. You do not have to carry the weight alone, for I am here to help you. Today I will take care of everything you need until your soul is completely satisfied. Remember that I will always be with you, giving you the strength you need to face any adversity. You just have to trust in me, even when you feel that no one understands you or that you are alone in your battles. I will always be here listening to every whisper of your heart, loving you and helping you in everything. At this moment, my child, I want you to feel the warmth of my love wrapping around you and comforting you. Understand that my love for you will never run out. It will be here for you at every moment of your life, ready to embrace and console you whenever necessary. Beloved child, lift your hands now and enjoy my love, which never fails or fades. It is my pure, sublime, and unconditional love for you. Receive it now. Receive my embrace. And in it, you will find the strength to move forward, the hope to face challenges, and the certainty that you will never, ever be alone. I love you, my child, with an eternal love. Have faith. Everything comes in its time. Let go and trust. Keep your faith alive and be patient. Remember that my timing is perfect. Do not worry about what tomorrow holds, nor cling to vain and fleeting things that will only bring discomfort to your life. Let go of everything that hinders me from pouring out my blessings on you. Stay away from the unbelievers and persist in prayer. Trust in my timing and do not despair. For many blessings will come into your life and all adverse situations will soon be behind you. Just be patient. Do not fear or lose heart, for I am by your side. Do not think that I am unaware of your needs. I know everything about you. I can see the burden you carry in your heart, the anguish that grips you when your finances are bad and when illness knocks at your door. But today and now, open your heart to my promises, to my counsel. Cling to my word, study it, have faith, and fill yourself with my presence. Everything will come in its time. I will bring peace and tranquility into your life, and I will shower you with blessings because you have placed your trust in me. Never forget that I am a God of power and miracles. I will not only pour out blessings and healing upon you, but also upon your family, your children, and your parents. You must trust in my timing. Be patient. Do not lose your composure or seek easy paths, for they can lead you away from me and destroy you. Do not stop praying. Do not stop studying my word so that you are never deceived by false doctrines. Do not be anxious about material things. Remember what the world offers is temporary, but what I offer is eternal and a blessing for your life. Keep trusting in my promises and everything will come in its time. I never delay nor forget, but I am and will be favorable to each of your needs. Do not despair, for I am by your side. Do not be impatient because of evildoers or envious of those who do wrong, for like grass they will soon wither, and like green plants they will soon die away. Trust in the Lord and do good. Dwell in the land and enjoy safe pasture. Delight yourself in the Lord, and He will give you the desires of your heart. Commit your way to the Lord, trust in Him, and He will do this. He will make your righteousness shine like the dawn, the justice of your cause like the noonday sun. Be still before the Lord and wait patiently for Him. Do not fret when people succeed in their ways, when they carry out their wicked schemes. Refrain from anger and turn from wrath. Do not fret. It leads only to evil, for those who are evil will be destroyed. But those who hope in the Lord will inherit the land. A little while and the wicked will be no more. Though you look for them, 
they will not be found. But the meek will inherit the land and enjoy peace and prosperity. The wicked plot against the righteous and gnash their teeth at them. But the Lord laughs at the wicked, for he knows their day is coming. The wicked draw the sword and bend the bow to bring down the poor and needy, to slay those whose ways are upright. But their swords will pierce their own hearts, and their bows will be broken. Better the little that the righteous have than the wealth of many wicked. For the power of the wicked will be broken, but the Lord upholds the righteous. The blameless spend their days under the Lord's care, and their inheritance will endure forever. In times of disaster they will not wither. In days of famine they will enjoy plenty, but the wicked will perish. The Lord's enemies are like the beauty of the fields. They will vanish, vanish like smoke. The wicked borrow and do not repay, but the righteous give generously. Those the Lord blesses will inherit the land, but those he curses will be destroyed. The Lord makes firm the steps of the one who delights in him. Though he may stumble, he will not fall, for the Lord upholds him with his hand. I was young, and now I am old, yet I have never seen the righteous forsaken, or their children begging bread. They are always generous and lend freely. Their children will be a blessing. Turn from evil and do good, then you will dwell in the land forever. For the Lord loves the just and will not forsake his faithful ones. Wrongdoers will be completely destroyed. The offspring of the wicked will perish. The righteous will inherit the land and dwell in it forever. The mouths of the righteous utter wisdom, and their tongues speak what is just. The law of their God is in their hearts, their feet do not slip. The wicked lie in wait for the righteous, intent on putting them to death. But the Lord will not leave them in the power of the wicked, or let them be condemned when brought to trial. Hope in the Lord and keep his way. He will exalt you to inherit the land. When the wicked are destroyed, you will see it. I have seen a wicked and ruthless man flourishing like a luxuriant native tree. But he soon passed away and was no more. Though I looked for him, he could not be found. Consider the blameless, observe the upright. A future awaits those who seek peace. But all sinners will be destroyed. There will be no future for the wicked. The salvation of the righteous comes from the Lord. He is their stronghold in time of trouble. The Lord helps them and delivers them. He delivers them from the wicked and saves them because they take refuge in Him. Rejoice, for you will triumph. This trial is bringing you closer to your destiny. Know that I have always been by your side in every achievement and every obstacle you have overcome. You are my precious creation and I have always guided and helped you when you needed me. Remember, you have nothing to fear. For in me, you are strong, brave, and capable of achieving everything you set your mind to. Nothing is impossible for you because you have everything you need to succeed. With my love and your effort, nothing will stop you. Do not worry about the obstacles that may arise. Do not give up when faced with challenges. These are opportunities to grow and learn, bringing you closer to your destiny of success and prosperity. Do not fear the trials you will face today or tomorrow, but also do not become complacent. Trust in my power and hold on to my hand. I will give you the strength and wisdom to overcome them. Have faith in me and do not doubt the abilities I have given you. I have endowed you with skills, gifts, and talents to achieve everything you desire. Do not let anyone tell you that you cannot do something, for you have the ability and talent to accomplish it. You only need perseverance and dedication to achieve all your goals. Always remember that you are my child, unique and special, and it is my desire to bless and prosper you in everything you undertake. 
Do not fear failure, for it is only part of the learning process. If something does not go well, do not be discouraged. Rise up, learn from your mistakes, and move forward with more strength and determination. The path to success is achieved through effort and dedication. Each step, each obstacle overcome, strengthens you and prepares you for what is to come. Do not be discouraged by setbacks. Instead, use them to propel yourself forward with renewed determination. You carry within you the potential to reach great heights. Keep fighting, and you will see how challenges turn into great opportunities. Opportunities to gain experience and achieve your dreams with more strength and wisdom. Trust in me, and I promise you will always have my support. Remember, you are not alone on this journey. Embrace every moment, every experience, for they are all part of the incredible journey that is life. Do not let doubts undermine your determination. Hold on to faith, cling to my word, and you will see how believing in my promises will take you further than you ever imagined. I know the path can be challenging, but in every challenge lies the opportunity to grow and develop the character that will take you beyond your own limits. So move forward with confidence, knowing that each step brings you closer to your goals. You are stronger than you think and more capable than you imagine. Trust in me and the abilities I have given you, for you are destined to shine and achieve everything you set out to do. You are a potential winner, and a sea of opportunities awaits you. Your faith and trust in me will be the tools that lead you to experience success and prosperity. Believe in me, and you will see how situations align in your favor. This is a time to grow in your faith, to raise your expectations, and to receive the blessings I have prepared for you. Elevate your prayers. Believe in my faithfulness and unconditional love. Together, we will tear down any wall that stands in your way to fulfillment and success. My desire is for you to achieve everything you set out to do and to have a future filled with blessings and fulfillment. Dear child, always remember that I will be here for you. Do not be discouraged if things do not go as expected, for even failure brings you closer to success as long as you do not give up. So, rejoice and celebrate each step you take toward your dreams. I assure you that you will triumph, you will move forward, and you will achieve everything you set out to do. Amen. Listen to my voice and do not doubt my covenant with you. Believe in me with all your strength, and I will bless everything you undertake. Ye. Come now and give me control of your life. Let me be with you. Remember that when you give me everything, be it illnesses, burdens, or worries, I receive them with love, for I am not unaware of your needs. Understand that I am the solution to your problems, the way out of all your conflicts, and the provision for all your needs. Trust in me from the depths of your being, and I assure you that I will grant the desires of your heart. Be fully confident that what you have entrusted to me with faith and without doubt, I will do in your life. You will receive the river of my love and a sea of wisdom. I will give you health, strength, courage, and many blessings. Have faith and believe, for blessed are those who believe without having seen. Take comfort, my child. I know that as you hear these words, you may still feel weak, afraid of facing life's challenges. I know your responsibilities are many and that everything around you can wear you down. I know you carry burdens that are very heavy for you. That is why today I bring rest for your soul. Come to my arms, release everything that takes away your peace, and let me give you new strength. Let me take care of you. Here I am. Do not doubt my words. Give yourself to me. Place your trust in me, and I will take care of everything. 
I will hold you in my arms of love and give you rest. Remember that I am the potter and you are the clay vessel I want to form. Just let yourself be shaped and I will give you a design you have never imagined. I will be your comfort, replacing your suffering with joy. My love will consume every expression of sadness on your face, bringing a fresh and abundant happiness. My joy will beautify your face, taking away all your suffering. Remember, I am your comforter. I am the one who sustains your life and gives direction to your daily walk. Beloved, do not stop listening to my voice. Let my words penetrate the depths of your being. I will give you wisdom, be your guide, and lead you along paths of righteousness. I will be your light in the darkness, the lamp that illuminates your path, so your foot does not stumble. This is why you must trust in me, because when you do, my powerful hand moves to work in your favor. I open a way where there was none. I open doors and put grace before you. Nothing is impossible for me when you trust. Just prepare your heart and never stop listening to my voice. Then, when you need me, with just a whisper I will answer your petition and respond to your prayer. For I am your God, and I love you. Just call out to me, and I will answer. I will show you great and hidden things you do not know. Because everything you ask in prayer, believing, you will receive. Remember, I am with you at all times. Nothing and no one can harm you. For I will deliver you from your enemies and everything that afflicts your life. Come now and give me your burdens and worries. Let me cleanse your heart and I will free you from all doubt and fear. Run to my arms, my child, and you will see how I work in your life with all my power. Come now and give me the throne of your heart. I will give you wisdom all your life. My word will be like a lamp to your feet and a light on your path. You will see how truth and discernment will accompany you every day. Your life will never be the same. Come to my arms, my daughter. Surrender your being to me. Lay your burdens before me. Let go of your worries and let me take care of everything. I will solve your problems, heal your illnesses, and provide for all your needs. I will open the doors of heaven and pour out blessings on you and your family until they overflow. I only ask that you be strong and courageous. Do not lose heart. Remember, I am with you. I will accompany you wherever you go. I will be your refuge and strength a real help in times of adversity. Trust in me and I will not fail you nor abandon you, for I am your almighty God. I have power over everything. I'm present in all places, in all things, I'm everywhere, and I will never abandon you. Just as I was with Moses before Pharaoh, so I will be with you wherever you go, always, even to the end of time. Remember, my child, that right now I am closer to you than you think. I walk by your side, sit with you, am in your mind and conscience. You will never be alone again. From now on, I will go before you as a mighty giant. Nothing and no one can harm you. I love you, my child, with all my heart, for you are my greatest treasure in whom I am well pleased. Today I put peace in your heart and freedom in your soul, because from now on, goodness and mercy will follow you all the days of your life, for you will dwell in my house for long days. Amen.